Hi guys! In today's vlog, I am going to show you a couple of different things. I am going to show you my skincare routine. This is a skincare routine that I've been doing for the last six months and it has honestly changed my skin. It just is always radiant, it's always moisturized, it just makes me look very youthful. It brings a lot of like youthfulness to my skin. So I thought I would just show you a couple of those products because I get so many questions from you guys asking me what I actually put in my face. That's the first thing. The second thing I'm going to show you is actually what we are currently doing in Miami right now, what I did over this weekend, which is a very special time to be in Miami during winters. A lot of people come here, they come here from Chicago, from New York, from all the north, from Europe, escaping the cold. And uh, it's just like really beautiful what goes on here this time of the year. So I thought I would just share with you. But before we jump into the vlog, I want to share with you something that's really cute, really special, really neat. And I thought that it was just perfect to share that with you today. So me and my girlfriends have this tradition that we do every year for Valentine's Day where we give each other really beautiful Valentine's Day presents. And this is a tradition that we started, I don't know, many, many years ago. We were still in high school and we just made a promise to each other that every year during Valentine's Day, we would always, no matter where we were in the world, no matter if we were married, not married, boyfriend, not boyfriend, kids, we would always, always make this day very special for us. So I want to show you what I got my girlfriends and what I'm going to be giving them for Valentine's Day. This is a yellow gold heart with a diamond and we all are going to have the same one. I think this is going to look so beautiful in its 18 length with a 16 adjuster. So in case they just want to layer it with whatever they have on already and wear it kind of like you know, short on the neck or if they just want to wear it by themselves and have it longer in the neck. I think that this is just such a beautiful gift to give a friend or someone that you love on a day like this just because it's something that is so dainty, so beautiful. I mean, and it's diamonds. Diamonds last forever. And what I love about this is that they never have to worry about taking it off when they shower, going into the beach, into the pool, when they're like putting lotion on. This is something that's gonna last them a lifetime and they're never gonna have to worry about it tarnishing or it losing, you know, its shine, its diamonds. I want to show you how beautiful the packaging is. This is the new packaging that Spiritual Gloss has just come out with for spring. It's a beautiful pink bag and it has like this um, beautiful like linen texture and uh, look at this pink bow. So it's all about, you know, receiving that gift and feeling just being in your complete feminine energy and just feeling that, you know, you received something with so much love and out of love. Basically, the box is pink and it comes, it goes inside this box. How cute is that? I just want to just talk to you a little bit about this last pair of diamond studs that I got. Maybe you saw them in my previous vlog. And if you're looking to get like a piece that you're gonna wear always, that you never have to take off, this is the perfect time to invest in a pair of diamond studs. And let me tell you why. So these diamond studs that I got in one carat with a diamond bezel around it, the price of these diamond studs if you go on any competitor website um brilliant earth is like ten thousand five hundred dollars and on blue nile is like you know 15k you can get this exact same earring in spiritual gloss for three thousand three hundred dollars that's using my 20 percent off code that i am going to be sharing with you here in the description box below and i'm also going to be putting it here across the screen i am really sorry if there's noise it's just like we're about to like make dinner and i just really wanted to make sure that you know i gave you this information there are different type of diamonds with different type of carrots you have one carrot half a carrot two carrots another pair of studs that i think you guys are gonna love so much are these studs that are 2.46 carats now if you go find these earrings in any other website they're gonna be 20 25k you can get them for seven thousand dollars in spiritual gloss and these are natural diamonds set in 14 karat white gold they're gonna last you forever so just go on the website and see if you like any of the diamond pieces that are there right now because with my 20 percent off code you're gonna be able to get a huge discount and this goes for the diamond tennis bracelets this goes for anything that has to do with diamonds on the website so now let's just jump into this vlog and we're gonna start with me doing my beauty 
routine that I do every single day in the morning. Good morning, my loves. Today is glow up day. I literally just got up and out of bed and look at what's going on. My hair, it needs a little TLC because it's kind of all over the place right now. I have to definitely go and get a glow up day today. I need to go and I have like this little hairs here, which you can't see on camera, but I can see them and they drive me crazy. And also my eyebrows are just, they need a good plucking because this right now, it's not okay. But good news this morning is that I have Gabby is in the kitchen making us some pancakes. Oh my God. Let me maybe pick up my hair because this is a little bit bad. As usual, it's a beautiful morning. And today we have, Gabby is going to make pancakes for breakfast. Morning. Hi. Gabby's back in the vlogs. So today we're having a little cheap morning and uh, Gabby is making some pancakes from scratch. We went to Trader Joe's yesterday and we got maple syrup. So I am just going, I, I was telling them that we need to go and have a glow up this morning because my mustache is not okay. Neither is my eyebrows. And neither, my eyebrows. And neither are your eyebrows. Gabby saw me this morning and she's like, uh, I can't see you with that mustache anymore. You need to go and we need to do it. And I was like, okay, we're gonna go do that. So we're gonna go do that right after. I just want to recommend this mix to you if you are one of those people that loves pancakes and you eat them on the regular but you really don't want to be going through the hassle of like getting all the ingredients and putting everything together maybe you're just pressed for time this mix from Trader Joe's is so good it's delicious it's very creamy it just dissolves really well when you look at it it's just there is no clumping and it honestly it has such a fresh taste also the calories are pretty low in this um, mix for three pancakes of four inches is 210 calories and that's really good and the great thing about this is that all you needed to put in was water and an egg everything else was inside and what's really cool is that if you look here it gives you recipes of um, different recipes if you want them skinnier if you want waffles if you want uh, biscuits so it's just a really really good mix the house is full of flowers it was Gabby's birthday a couple of days ago and these flowers were delivered to her so lots of fresh flowers in the house let's start by I'm sorry if you can hear that in the background that's like the extractor of humidity from the bathroom which I think I'm gonna get them to remove that it turns on at the same time as I flick on the light switch because then you can hear it on the sound of the camera and I hate it this is just a lip scrub I'm scrubbing my lips I'm going to make sure that I get rid of all of the dead skin and that they're just nice and plump obviously if you don't have like a you don't need a stick like this to do this lip exfoliator you can do it with um, sugar and honey and it does the same thing. I'm going to do it a little bit just all over just because I wear so much lipstick and if you don't clean that properly, that's how you get the blackheads right around on the, on the borders of your lips. And it looks crusty and it's not a cute look. So, we'll do that. Hmm. and I am going to wash my face this is what I use to wash my face it's called it's from La Roche Posay and it's called hydrating gentle cleanser it's for normal to dry skin I just put this much in it and
you need to make sure that whatever it is that you're using to wash your face doesn't strip it away of all its natural oils i used to wear i used to use um soaps before that were that would leave my skin looking very dry even though it felt very clean it was just so dry and then i soon learned that oh no wonder i had like a little black under eye this morning because i still had some mascara on that's really bad makeup tip number one make sure you remove all your makeup before you go to sleep i can say i'm very guilty of that sometimes i get lazy and i remove it but i don't do like the full removing cleansing that i should be doing routine this is good because the reason why i like this cleanser is because it really cleanses and my uh my skin it takes away all my makeup but it's very milky so i don't feel that my face is just completely dried up so this has soap free sulfate free fragrance free ceramide niacinamide la roche posay prebiotic thermal water and then it says a gentle hydrating cleanser formula with la roche posay prebiotic thermal spring water to cleanse skin of dirt makeup and impurities while maintaining skin's natural moisture barrier and ph helps restore skin comfort and retains essential moisture leaves skin feeling clean comfortable and hydrated trust me this has been excellent for my skin i am going to take <coughs> I like i like to take a little washcloth and really go in there you know in a circular motion and make sure that i get all the makeup and everything i put in my face during the week out of there because i want my skin to be healthy and look glowy plus i'm not in my 20s anymore so <laughs> i gotta really take care of my skin if i want to have a youthful glow Ew. Ew. Now I'm going to moisturize my face and I've been using this cream from Old Harrington. You can get this at Sephora since last summer. So this is a banana bright eye cream, vitamin C and collagen boosted. And for me, it just prevents my under eyes from getting too dry and like creasy just keeps them nice and plump and it also brightens your under eye highly highly recommend i love this one another eye cream that i am obsessed with and i swear by this is incredible this is from la roche posay this one is called P piment clair so basically what it does is that it brightens and anti-dark circles and you use this in the morning and at night and you put it in your eyes and the, in the contour of your eyes this just how can i explain you it comes with like a little applicator you put it on and the thing with this is that it's like juice for your skin it this one is like wow this is my ultimate ultimate true favorite my skin under my eyes is just so moisturized with this the the brightening cream i've been using it the the old Harrington brightening cream i've been using it since last summer so i have already been using it for six months and like honestly my under eyes and my skin on my under my under eyes is amazing i started using this one in december i got it in st bart's and you can get it you know wherever they sell la roche posay they sell it at walgreens cvs sephora this cream is just incredible it just leaves it so plumped and moisturized now we are going to put 
moisturizer to the face and we're also going to use La Roche-Posay. I honestly love La Roche-Posay because everything they do is so nice and the results are so good. This, there's no chemicals in there, everything is the best for your skin. So this one is a hyaluronic acid moisturizer, 72 hour hydration for radiant and replumped skin. Don't we love the sound of all of that? Because I do. So we take it. Don't worry, I'm gonna leave it all linked in the description box below. I normally do two pumps, that way I have enough for my, oh, oh my God, this is like, mm, it feels incredible on your skin. It's fresh. I love to use this moisturizer on La Roche-Posay under eye cream, under my makeup, because when I do my makeup over it, it just looks like my skin is flawless, you know, because since my skin is so hydrated under, it doesn't look cakey, my makeup, because my skin is not absorbing my makeup in order to hydrate itself. It's absorbing this moisturizer to hydrate itself so then my makeup can sit wonderfully on my skin. I'm gonna do another pump because right now my skin is so dry. Mm. Oh, Gabby was right. Oh, mm -hmm. so nice. And last but not least, I am going to put on sunblock. This one is from La Roche Posay, and this is an SPS 50 because I live in Miami and it's very, very sunny here. I live on the beach and I do not want to get old. We don't have time to get old. So we put sunblock. And one thing I really dislike about sunblocks is that they smell like sunblocks and they leave this horrible white film in your face. This one does not do that. It does not smell like sunblock. It does not leave a horrible white film on your face. So this i've been using for years highly recommend i wouldn't use anything else i have the same one for my body but oh this smells it just this one just kind of has like a little bit of like a it doesn't really smell like anything like i'm gonna show you the one that i use for my body i this is the one that i use for my body is also the from la roche posay anti alias 50 and you can see I use it a lot. I have two bottles. One of them is almost done. One of them is a new one because I never go outside without sunblock. And these ones are great because they don't leave that white film in your body and it doesn't feel like all sticky and greasy and smelling like that chemical sunscreen that we know that smell. That is my morning routine. What I do to my face at night, the routine is completely different. I have dry skin. It's very dry and then it's very oily here in the T-zone, but I overall have very, very dry skin. My skin requires a lot, a lot of moisture. And then I live in a very hot place. So I have to be very careful what I use in my skin as a moisturizer and what I use in my skin as makeup. That way when I go outside into the heat, I don't turn into a grease ball. So if you guys have a similar skin type to me and you have any other questions, please let me know in the comment section below. I am happy to answer all of them. Now let's go check on these pancakes, which by the way, I can kind of smell. So hopefully they're ready because I am starving. Yes, oh, that looks delicious. Thank you. This one is also from Trader Joe's. This yeah. is so delicious. It's organic maple syrup from Vermont. And then you have approximately 100 calories for all the syrup that we dumped in the pancakes. Let's go eat this. Oh, thank you, Gabby. Let's eat breakfast. Today is absolutely gorgeous, beautiful, and promising. 
It's going to be a beautiful Saturday morning. Oh, look at this guy. He's already out on his jet ski, having the time of his life. Hello. Good morning. Yes, yes, yes. No. Elizabeth down. Yes, I am mustache and eyebrow free. Thank you for making me beautiful and torturing me. And torturing me. <laughs> Look at her smiling. Thank you. My eyebrows are nice and clean and thick now. And I have no more mustache. On any typical Saturday or Sunday, what we usually do is we meet up with our friends, we go out on a boat, and we take it out to just the Miami Bay. The surrounding waters in Miami are really beautiful, they're really calm and clear, so we like to do a lot of water sports and just enjoy a nice afternoon and have lunch all together. From there, as the night falls, we take a trip from South Beach down to the Miami River and that's when you enter all of Brickell and you can see this beautiful night sky and tonight we're gonna go to a restaurant called Sea Spice which it's music you have beautiful dinner it's a French restaurant kind of like Central Park. 